Hello and welcome in. We are in for a pack war between Nate's breaks and unboxings and Steel Family Cards. Hosted by as, hosted as by, promised. There you go, as promised, <laughs> and hosted by Steel Family Cards. Um, we are going to get into a couple uh, value packs of 2019 Gypsy Queen. Boom, right here. Steel Dad was able to find some online for a really good deal, so we are just going to do a little battle tonight. So here we go. All right, so we had a selection of value packs. I actually have a few left. Well, I shouldn't say a few, a couple left. Um, so we went ahead and picked our packs from the selection. So we've got Nate's Breaks and Unboxings here on the left. We've got the home team over here on the right. And uh, I guess if we're using the, the baseball analogy here, we need to let the visiting team hit first and give the uh, home team the opportunity to come back. So. We'll turn this over to Nate's Breaks and Unboxings, and then I will come back later. So we haven't really determined any. I'm going to set uh, Mr. Steele's over here we'll, so you can still see them on screen. we got mine here. We haven't really set any rules, but we're just going to kind of go as what we agree upon are the best cards. So uh, we've got two value packs. Each of these have three packs and then your three exclusive parallels in here. So let's do this. I'm going to go ahead and do the quick method of doing both of them, just so that we don't have a 45 minute video. I doubt that would be a problem anyhow, so <laughs> we'll do the... With four value packs, probably not a big deal. Yeah. Um, so we'll do the greens last. Let's see what we can find. We are looking at six cards per pack. There you go. Shoei Otani. On the cover, doing much better this year in some training. And you can see in the background, these are all cards that have been pulled from uh, value packs in my openings. And I Previously. was... Obviously, score, you found a Yellich. Nice. Woo -woo. Yeah, Mr. Steele over here is trying to put the set together, and is this one you were missing? Yes. Nice. I'm missing 27 total now. I got to... So. Yeah, we're using a diff the Steele family setup, and it's different than mine, so I got to hold the cards differently. Um, I didn't know there was a Tarot of the Diamond numbered parallel so that was a neat discovery i knew there were fortune teller parallels i didn't know the tarot was so we got christian yelich starting us off josh bell dustin pedroia cj cron him and jake lamb he who shall not be named of that team no <laughs> of the team that has been struck from memory no not all of them if we had a yordine in here i'd totally Ian Desmond, Michael Brantley, I'll say his name, Aaron Judge, here come to judge. We've got a Tarot of the Diamond, J.D. Martinez, not terrible, Joey Lucchesi, Casey, whatever, Jacob Junis, finishing us off. i do something real quick here. Let's check our backs for bazookas. If I'm opening cards, we're probably not going to find bazookas. <laughs> Well, I, I, in all of the 2019 I've opened, I found one. And it's... in the 2020, it seems to be more frequent because I know I found two, and I've opened less 2020 than 2019 stuff. Yeah, I, yeah. Manny Margot, Trevor Story, Kendris Morales, Jose Barrios, Brandon Lau. Rookie. That's the thing with 2019 is the rookie logo is so faint. And a Kyle Hendricks. Nice cubby card there. All right, that's the first three base packs. Let's get to the next one for our second value pack. We've got a fortune teller in here, I can already tell. Yadi Molina. Nice. Mike Trout. Score. I'm going to throw him down there. Derek Rodriguez. We got a Juan Soto fortune teller. That's a cool one. Not numbered. Uh, Christian Stewart and Chance Adams. It'd be really funny if that Christian Stewart was a bazooka back because that's the uh, bazooka back that I pulled. The other I day. doubt it's going to be, yeah. <laughs> I doubt that it will be, but yeah, it would be kind of ironic if that's the one that we pulled. <laughs> absolutely. Yeah, if I had the Soto already, that was not going to be. Andrew Penintendi, Sandy Alcantara, Starling Marte. 
we've got another tarot of the world Ozzy Albies. Rufned Odor, Carlos Rodin. All right, I'm gonna, how do I, yeah, let's do that. I kind of feel like I'm gonna have a chance. You're gonna have a very good chance. <laughs> Uh, I guess we could have come up with a point system, but nah. we'll do subjective. Yeah. Joe Panic. Don't panic. Alex Gordon. Justin Upton. Josh Harrison. Nick Williams and Max Kepler. Let's check the backs. Nope. All right. Those in, with 2020, I found that these kind of packs were the more generous. For me, let's see. And that's that was my experience with 2019 stuff that I've opened so far. But that was one of the bigger duds that I've seen. <laughs> I would agree. But that's okay. Let's go. Victor Robles. Adam Eaton. And Freddie Freeman. That's not, no, that's a, bad not a bad one. one. I'll throw that down there. Mr. MVP. All right. Last for Nate's breaks and unboxings, we've got Yon Mancada, Starling Marte, and Didi Gregorius. So there you go. Um, not a whole lot. You got lots of room to do better. I'll just say that. Well, so we'll set these kind of here. Oh, you can't really see, but they are just off to the side of the screen there. Um, and now I'm going to make room for Steel Family cards and readjust the cap camera because I hit it. At least you didn't drop it and have it fall down to the floor like I did not long ago. So we'll go ahead and uh, do the same methodology here. We'll rip the cello part and we will uh, get these down. That one kind of opened in the middle. That's kind of interesting. At least there's legit glue holding that in place as opposed to that one time I got, oh. it was like Elmer's glue. Yeah, that was, I saw that and that was, that was a horrible situation. Yeah. <laughs> Happens. It does, lesson but learned, it, lesson it's learned. unscrupulous people and... Yeah. Crazy times. All right. Pack numero uno. All right, so we've got a Matt Chapman, Jameson Talion, Paul DeYoung, Fortune Teller of Edwin Diaz, Kyle Seeger, and Avasail Garcia. So I guess we throw the Fortune Teller over there just because it's an insert. Yep. Not the greatest Fortune Teller, but... The uh, psychic was off that day. <laughs> Daniel Polka, Ryan Braun, Jan Gomes, Brandon Woodruff, Travis Shaw, and Jake Bowers. I'm assuming, yep, nothing there. Well, I found typically the uh, inserts either in the second to last or next to last position. Seems to be, anyhow. All right, Brian Anderson, Marcelo Zuna, Glaber Torres. That's not too bad. <gasps> yes, nice. a short print. Oh, oh, and that's a good one. Nice. Well, they're all good, but that's a sweet. I don't think I've seen Nico that Nico Goodrum. I don't think I have either. I, I haven't even really seen it for sale. Well, I'm going to have to say that I think you just won the the war with that card well we'll see maybe we can put it way out of reach from uh, everybody's opinions here uh, with what we find out you know give us a comment below and let us know uh, who you think won and you know we're always looking for interesting comments Ooh, there we go we got a uh, Zach Cozart uh, logo swamp and Jack Flaherty oh, dang man so it appears that I picked the uh, the good ones here. But yeah, you know, feel free to leave like, subscribe, all that good jazz. We will link each other's pages on in the descriptions below. Yes. You will likely see the same video on both of our pages, I will just tell you that. Yes, definitely. Billy McKinney, Whit Merrifield, Marcus Stroman, Miles, Miles Mikolas, Scott Kingery, and Taylor Ward. Assume, yep. All right, last base pack for Steel Family cards going on here. Let's put this out of reach. All right, Kyle Freeland, I have a ton of him. Sean Manaya, yeah, B-Craw. 
Fortune Teller, Max Scherzer, John Gray, and Orlando Arcia. Nothing there. All right, so now our greens. Oops, there we go. I love that beard. Kind of looks like your beard. There you go. All right, so, oops, <laughs> off camera. So we got Alex Gordon, Robbie Ray. Oh, nice Mookie. Nice Mookie. Yeah. I, I'm going to go ahead and just call it. I'm, I'm pretty I, sure I, that uh, you, I've got it here. That bow was like the uh, <laughs> walk-off, and then you just continued scoring for the sake of, for the heck of it. All right, so we got Daniel Polka. Sean Newcomb, and last card is Mark Trumbo. So, yeah, there we go. That's uh, easy that's win it. for easy win for Steel Family cards. Yeah, just you know, as a reminder of what what gave us our win here. It's cool. Bo card. Jackson. That's a cool card. Yes, it is. All right. Well, thank you for watching. I hope you're all doing well out there, staying safe and healthy wherever you are. And I'll just say my thing, and then. Um, so be good to each other, be kind to each other, care for each other, love each other, and ta-ta for now.